Welcome to Trick Your Users to Test More with Gamification. Hey, I'm Eric, and um, there was a blog post the other day that really caught my attention. Um, it's uh, it's by my fellow uh, MVP, Gerardo Renteria. I'm sorry, I'm butchering your name. My, uh, my, my Spanish is non-existing, uh, but the the whole idea here is that let's make testing a game uh in business central so so if you do a b and c you get points and you know, there's a leaderboard and stuff like that uh, which is an awesome idea and uh, gerardo built a complete app for this so I th we have to take a look at it because I think this is super cool. So what I did is that I, um, from his GitHub, which where the code is sitting, there's a link somewhere. Uh, the code is sitting here. So I took that, dumped it into a new app and um, hit a five. And uh, that's, and then I started recording uh, the video. So with that in mind, I think we, what we have to do is take a look at this and then figure out how he, he did it. Um, so I installed the app and I can see that there is a role now called the gaming user. Um, meaning that if we look here, the a profile called gaming user so that's pretty good um, and uh, there is a role center with that which just has menu items there was a, a demo data uh, functionality that I quickly clicked uh, before hitting record and I think this one sets up achievements and sets of things so so let's uh let's see here so we have my gaming experience i have a profile i'm eric i'm a novice i have total total points zero and i have no batches my department points nothing here so so how how do i get a, gain a point because I, I, I want to win this thing. Uh, there's an achievement guide. Let's make that wider, make it bigger. So I can create a sales quote for a customer. Okay, let me, let me, I, I can create a sales quote. I'm good at sales quotes. So I go new. A customer name, a datum. Get rid of that. We don't care about credit limits here. I want to sell a chair. The Paris chair. Come on. Five. So now I created a quote. Uh, should I release it? I don't know. It's released. So let's go back. I have 25 pounds. I have a batch and I have 25 pounds. I am in the lead. I am winning this content. No discussion and no mentioning that I'm the only one participating. Oh, hang on. There is already somebody else in here. So I'm not winning. I, by the way, I love the Unicode. You, you know, you you know that I, I enjoy the uh, use of Unicode uh, things. This is this is this is just awesome. Uh, so how do I get more? Because I have only twenty five points, and and that's not very good. Uh, so how do I get more points? Let's go back and look at the achievement guide. Post a sales order with amount over ten thousand. And there's a frequency, so repeatable. 
so I get a first okay so there's some I get points for the first sales order and then I get the big deal so okay so let's go back to my sales quote because we might as well so let's reopen this one and let's sell a lot of chairs this customer is very so we released the the sales quote let's make an order boom so the question is does it does it know that i created the order this right way around let's see i'm just gonna post it go for it ship an invoice i'm gonna rule the leaderboard okay so let's go back and check aha i have 625 points this feels nice and, and three batches uh, let me check the leaderboard in fourth place but i have only sales point i have do not have any finance points or service points um hmm so let me go back and uh, register a new vendor in the system haha -ha, i can do that i can create a vendor <laughs> uh, go away new vendor boom that's it let's see yeah yeah yeah, yeah. i have s got 60 finance points now so i'm demo user three i am gaining on you uh, there's no service nobody has service point is that because there are no okay so that's pretty cool but let's figure out how we i i love it so so gaming admin achievement setup aha so if we create a new one um let's uh, posting group create a new uh, customer posting group and i think i need 450 points for that trigger type customer created sales order created big deal invoice posted quote created items so these are hard coded which is kind of fair enough so so how do we how, how do we how do we get around that uh, trigger type so what is trigger type trigger type is an enum aha it is extendable so i could have created another app that extended this one but i'm just gonna get lazy here and saying that i want posting group uh, there i'm gonna follow the single line approach here um customer posting group created semicolon and then what um so what do i do so i think the easiest way if we say contact created and then we go for find all references so we have an achievement event code unit haha uh -huh. so if we just copy all this code very nice laid out code by the way it's that's uh that's it's just cool customer posting group on after insert event uh on after uh, contact no on after customer posting group insert uh, I think that one is just it's 
So what do we get here? Um, there we go. If not run trigger, then exit process. So we want to add in a posting group event and we want to do rec dot code, I guess. Uh, posting group, posting group. Look at this, but the comment on the labels and everything. Let's uh, hit a five. I'm going to create a posting group in a second because I forgot to turn this one off. Um, customer posting groups. New. That's probably good. Boom. My gamification achieved leaderboard. What? I did. I, there was something I didn't do. Ah, ah, ah. I think we missed the. I did not finish this one. So, posting customer posting group, and I won 450. So I think we have a tab here that we never complete. It doesn't matter. So this is customer posting group created. Department is sales. Difficulty. You got to be an expert. Dudes. Create a new customer posting group. Uh, Alt Q. Uh, customer posting group minimum threshold. Ah, oh, that was the uh, the parameter into the size only one time. Yeah, batch icon. Um, Unicode Explorer um, group customer. No, um, person. We want, uh, what do we want? How about the rock? How can a person climbing be in a official Unicode's? I, I, I love it, but, but it's also kind of ridiculous. Okay, so I guess I need to do another one. Customer posting group. Oops. New to. Boom, boom. Gaming. Ha ha. Oh, I'm still behind. Demo user five. You are. Uh, okay. Uh. <laughs> Anyway, see, I, I, I get I get caught up in, in the game. I think I need to win this. You know, uh, I think I need to win this. Otherwise, this is a achievement guide. So what can I do? I can, uh, I can just post another sales order. Haha. <laughs> I am very good at selling shares to a datum. A datum has bought hundreds of chairs for me. This time I think we're gonna go over to London. Boom. Post, ship an invoice. No. Oh, oh Asher. Go away, Asher. There he is, the winner. Um, I still have, anyway, um, there's a link below to, uh, 
to the blog post. Uh, I think this is this 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 is so cool. Uh, so uh, thanks and and very well implemented. It's 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 nice. It's, it was easy to add stuff. Uh, kudos. Well executed. I like it and and I. I I'm still smiling at all the Unicode badges because that, that, that's just cool. Uh, anyway, um, check this one out. This was pretty cool ale hacking. I'm sure the, the this video is also good ale hacking. So check it out. I'll see you there. Take care. Bye.